Hello and welcome to another episode of here of Let's Talk Vancouver. I'm your host, Erin Price Emery, and this is where we interview and we chat with local businesses. So today I'm with Nancy Jelnek and she is the owner here of Barking Babies. Hi, Nancy. Hello. So what kind of store is this? Oh my God, I think it's like the best store. I think it's the best store too, definitely in downtown Vancouver. Yeah, I mean, it's, um, it's all about um, accessories, fun fashion, um, treats, um, we do grooming, uh, and it's all for our barking babies. Okay. Yeah. So I noticed there's a lot of like small, cute little outfits and everything. Is it mainly for little dogs, medium or big dogs? Like what do you usually cater towards? So barking babies is any size dog. Do okay. All dogs are our babies, so it we doesn't don't matter. discriminate. <laughs> yeah, I do not. We do not discriminate. Lots of the cutesy, cutesy outfits. Yeah, they yeah. only come in small sizes. That makes but sense. But I mean, like practical things like, like sun shirts and sun hats and rain jackets and yeah. fleeces, things like that for bigger dogs. Okay. We carry all of that, but you know the cute little dresses, and that's just for the wee ones. Yeah. Dresses, and bow ties, yeah, and whatnot. no bow ties, also for big dogs. Yes, that's right. Okay. Yeah, big dogs love bow ties. Okay. Uh, great for weddings and special events, uh, and then we have beautiful collars and leashes. Like, okay, we even can fit Great Danes. So oh, wow. our collars go all the way up to twenty six inches. Okay, so yeah, do all dogs, they're all our babies. So lots of accessories, lots of clothing. Yes. And what about dog toys? Do you also sell like? Frisbees well, or balls Yeah, or... look behind us. We oh, yeah, have, look at this. We have tons here. Such a great selection of toys, all sorts of toys. Starbucks. Yeah. That's so cute. Yeah. I mean, from, from plushies to, um, you know, uh, teething toys. Uh, okay. Even yeah. have, like, rope pulleys. And we have toys that have fun sounds, like just like a like a chicken leg. Um, yeah, and then over over on that side we have like puppy teethers. So yeah, all okay. sorts of toys and okay. puzzle toys. I see. Puzzle toys are a great seller too. Okay, so you are one of the rare shops here in downtown Vancouver. I know a lot of people also sell online mm -hmm. um, because a lot of people close down their shops mm -hmm. or they just don't have a shop. Do you also mm -hmm. have an online shop and component? We do. Okay. Uh, and luckily, right before COVID hit, we updated to this amazing system just on a whim. Uh -huh. Thank God. So yeah, I mean. The good thing about the web store too is people can see what we have in store, mm -hmm. but a lot of people that live locally, they like to come in and bring their dogs yeah. because I, I think it's important because then you can try on collars and clothing. You can really look and feel, touch the toy, see yeah. what you like. Uh, but then we do have customers a lot from the East Coast that, that okay. shop here online. Mm -hmm. It's because a lot of product that we carry, it's very exclusive to us. Uh, okay. We carry some brands from Europe and from Japan that we're the only shop uh, that carries it. Oh, I see. Okay. So are you, do you source it yourself? I know the, some owners, they don't necessarily. I do it all. You do it all. I do it all. Oh, wow. I do it all. So you're busy. I'm busy. Yeah. You know I didn't do? Who is this little guy? Oh, I didn't even ask and I'm this is, talking. This is Monsieur Pepe. Oh. Yes. He's my little six month old Chihuahua. He's a new addition to the family. Um, you know, a, a nice little mascot. Yeah. Um, does he come here every day when you're working? Yeah, 24 seven. He's with me 24 seven. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. And does he get along with the other dogs? Cause I know when you have, you yeah. have a lot of dogs that come in, right? Right. Trying on the clothes and he, buying stuff. He, he does. He's, he's getting better and better. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, when they're this young, they're, they're, you know, they're a little cautious, but yeah, yeah he's, he's, he's getting better and better for sure. Oh my God, he's yeah. So Sorry. Going back to the yes. online components. Right. So, um, you can come to the store and you can shop yep. and then you can go online onto your website. What yep. is your website called? Barkingbabies.com. Barkingbabies.com. Yep. So you can go in yep. and you can find out what you want. So yeah. do you sell everything that you sell online in I the do. shop? I do, as I well? do. Okay. I do have some things in store that I don't sell online because mm -hmm. they're very exclusive. I might have one or two pieces. So I'll let a couple of customers know or, or I'll post it on social media and I'll say, hey, we got a couple left. Yeah, social okay. media has been great too. We're, we're at Barking Babies on all realms of social media. Awesome. TikTok. Uh, Twitter, yeah. Instagram, Facebook, it's at Barking Babies. And you also started this new thing that you do a feature on Fridays, yes. right? So yes. you have a video that comes out yes. and then it's, what do you do for your Fridays? So feature Fridays is really like, what's uh, what's happening uh it's it's very seasonal as well so the last few ones we've had you know on, on cooling products because mm -hmm. it's been really hot yeah, may was hot a scorcher so we started cooling products in may and you know it's canada day weekend coming up so we've done a couple of features on canadian treats okay yeah I'm so and then one fun one that we just did i can't wait for it to come out is um car travel and car seats so oh, that's a fun one. That would yeah. be a good one. So there's a lot of great content, a lot of great stuff that we that we were able to do on Future Fridays. Oh, that's yeah. excellent. Okay. So you also have a grooming because I yes. know that I take my little dog yes. Mochi here yes. and he gets groomed yes. oh my god, all the time because he's got such long hair. And so 
how did that incorporate, like how did you get sure. a dog grooming into a store? Sure. So I used to be across the street and my, my store was only 300 square feet. This space is a thousand square feet. So before I moved to this space, um, one of uh, a groomer that I knew was grooming my Yorkie. So I said to her, I said, hey, um, I'm expanding. I'm thinking of opening up a grooming section. Do you want okay. to join? She said yes. Okay. And so since then, um, that's her name is Christy. I've also hired another groomer named yeah. Veronica. Okay. So now we have two groomers, and we're grooming seven days a week. Uh, wow. Super busy. It's been fantastic. Okay. Yeah. I love it here. You know, this place is so great and so amazing. I come in and I shop for my little mochi, and then tons of people in the neighborhood. It's like, if you live, especially if you live in Yelltown, you definitely, if you have a small dog, yeah. you come here. They yeah. get groomed here. You know who we are. Lots yeah. Of treats. Yeah. Um, so Nancy, how did you get started? So a lot of people ask like, how did you, like how long have you had this store? And 20 like, years next year. 20 years? You've had this store yep. for 20 years? 20 years next oh year. God. So I, op I opened in 2004. Oh my God. That's yeah, so labor crazy. of love. I still love it. It feels like yesterday, so I'm super lucky. Yeah. Um, I think ha adding the grooming business helped a lot, you know, because retail can be a funny thing, right? Yeah. And especially when COVID hit. And, oh my God. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, 20 years, still going strong. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And what's your What was your journey? Like, why did you want to open up a dog so, store? Like, weren't you scared to like? Open I was. Shop? I was lucky. I was very lucky because the store, the uh, initial spot that I opened up, the 300 square foot spot, mm -hmm. it was just the mom and pop who were renting the spot. Okay. My contract was two pages long, and I was like, so I want to sell just dog clothes. And they're like, oh. I said, but I don't know if it's going to work. Mm -hmm. So if I'm here for three months, can I have an out? And they said, yeah, just give us an extra month's rent. I'm like, let's you, do it. Yeah, usually they're like, buying no, and buying con con contract, like, contracts. Like this. Yeah. So when I moved here, my contract was like this. And there was no... <laughs> You can go out after a month. It yeah. was like you are here for five years. But you've already. But then I knew exactly. I was in that, that small space for three years, yeah. and I knew oh, people will buy dog clothes. People will buy dog clothes. Yes. It's crazy how much so many people they love like we just love our animals we so do. much. We do. And we always want to dress and accessorize them. Yes. And buy They're really a part of our family. So. They are. Yeah. Just love them so much. Yeah. So are you open seven days a week? Are yeah. you open okay. seven days a week, Monday to Friday, from ten to five thirty. Weekends ten to five. Okay. Yeah. I see. Close statutory holidays. We gotta take a break. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah it makes sense. Yeah. So you come in, you can do some shopping, you can book in to get grooming. Yes. Can you can you take me on a tour of your shop? Sure, let's do it. Okay. All right, so we are in the store here and Nancy, give us a door. Okay. Uh, let's start right here. Yeah. Our sports section. You have a sports section. We sure do. Oh my god, BC Lions go. BC Lions, we got hockey, we got uh, we got uh, football here. Awesome. Right, Vegas yep. one. Yep. Um, yeah, so that's fun. We have a little birthday section over here with Shoot. birthday hats and things like that. Uh, you saw our toy section already. Yep. Lots of great toys. Uh, if we move along the store, we then uh, we have beautiful collars and leashes. Okay. A lot of our collars and leashes, uh, they're local, they're Canadian, uh, U.S. I also have uh, some from France wow. and from Italy Gorgeous. and from Germany. So, you know, the Italians have really beautiful leather, so that's why I like to... Uh, bring my collars in from there. But then again, right. same with some can Canadian brands too. And harnesses as well. So yep, harnesses, harnesses. for the little doggies. Yep, lots of harnesses. Uh, then over here we have all of our beds. We have harnesses hanging. Have you seen anything cuter? Look at this little harness. Adorable. I love it. And beds, lots of beds. Lots of beds too. Yeah, okay. lots of And then our treat section is pretty amazing. I'd say about 70% of all of our treats are Canadian brands. We mm -hmm. love supporting local. Okay. Uh, a lot of it is organic. It's all natural. It's what nice. my dogs eat. I don't carry anything that my dogs don't eat. Okay. Uh, yeah, and then these are our cookies here. Um, they're baked here in Canada. Okay. Uh, they're yogurt, peanut butter cookies. Huge seller for us. And we, we really? package them up really nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. We sell a ton. Okay, yeah, okay. and then the rest of the store is more kind of our clothing and our accessories. Okay. So, Look at these. you know, yeah, little t shirts. You know, awesome. we, we little sweaters, yeah. things like that. We have our change table right here. So our this change, is yes. This is what our is change, a change table. Well, what does this mean? For example, let's uh, I'll show you. So yeah. let's say we want to try this on Pepe. Yeah. And I go Pepe. Let's try this oh. on. And we use this table because it's a little bit easier than being down on the ground. That makes sense. Yeah. And, and look at my good little guy. Look how good he is. Oh, oh he's such a good little guy. So and great. he's just getting used to me putting clothing on him. So he's super yeah. tiny. So this is extra extra small. Adorable. Okay, so our little dogs, anybody can come in if they want yes. to try on some outfits here. They yes. can just pick the outfits and then put their little pups on here and then try them and on. And try it on. That's right. And okay. then you can see some more little outfits over here as well. I see. Okay, yeah. great. So uh, take me a tour of the grooming section. Okay, all right. Let's head on over here. Awesome. Okay, so we are in the grooming section of Barking Babies. That's right. So this is the area where we meet and greet the customers. Okay. And then we have the section in the back here where our groomer is. All right. So, uh, and Veronica's here working with one of our clients named Coco. Have a look.
All right, one final last question here for Nancy, the owner of Barking yes. Babies. If you were to pick anywhere in Vancouver, around the world, where would you pick as your place to live? 110%. Yale Town. Yale Town. No. That's my hood. My That's business hood. is here. I, I live a block away. This is my hood. You love Yale Town. Love Yale Town. Makes sense because your store is located here in Yale Town on Homer Street. Excellent. So thank you so much for doing this. Thanks for having me. No problem. If anybody has any questions or they want to buy any accessories for their little furry friend, they're going to go to BarkingBabies.com. They're going to want to buy stuff or they're going to come in, say hi to Nancy here, and get a dog room. So I'm Erin Price Emery and I'm with... Nancy, Barking Babies. <laughs> awesome. Thanks so much. Thanks.